No man, girl, come right out. Girl look good. Mm. Girl look real good. Hi loves, welcome back to my channel and today I just like to talk about getting over anxiety you know everybody's staying in everybody is in quarantine well most persons this virus has gotten out of hand and I know a lot of persons are feeling down well here are a couple tips that I suggest that you do at home so stay tuned guys Blessings fall for my life and gratitude is a must. Okay, so this basically helps you to get through being anxious. It helps you to be grateful. It helps you to be thankful for the things that you have. Thankful for things that God has provided for you. It has little prompts in it that can actually guide you in writing. So I got this the other day and I spent basically $20 on it and it has this little thing to keep your pages to know where you reach in the book and so tip number two is to get yourself a journal and just you know writing it writing it daily just to express your feelings you can journal in the morning or you can use your gratitude journal so sometimes I may want to use this or sometimes I just want to write. Just getting your thoughts out is a great way to just express your feelings and to get all the stuff that has been built up inside out on paper. You can also do daily devotionals. This is one of the books I use. I have not been consistent in doing this. However, let me show you one of the pages I did. So basically, you can color on this page. You read the daily devotional and then you can write your thoughts on it. So it's a really good book. Um, this one comes with a date. So the dates are on top and you use it daily. But I've been a bit inconsistent with this. This was a Christmas gift from my mom. So... And one of the main things that I would stress on is basically just pampering yourself. Yeah. Pampering yourself. You're not able to go to the spa at this time. Just take some time out and pamper yourself. So I went to Fontana and I got this foot thingy majiggy. It's a peppermint moisturizing foot mask. So if you're at home, you want something to do just to make yourself feel good, you can get a sheet mask. This one is for your feet. You can get a face sheet mask and actually do that. And do your makeup. So I actually didn't do this makeup. My second mom came over and she, you know, glammed up my face. So if you actually want to see this video, it should be up soon. And you can actually see how she achieve this look for the eyeshadow also i would suggest lighting your favorite candle right i know it's a small it's really small but small thing to do it smells really amazing just light a candle in your room listen to some music relax and yeah whole of vibes the next thing I would suggest is just reading. Yeah. You have the time now, take up a book, read. I know it's really hard because it's hard for me. Read a book. This book is really good. Becoming by Michelle Obama. Read a book. Um, write a review on the book. You can actually go online, look up free books, use Audible. Just do something educational. I know it's a bit difficult to do that because i have been trying to wake up set myself on a routine and it has not been working i'm not perfect right nobody's perfect so just try set small goals small goals even to try exercising exercising one of the major things too 
but I realize exercising at home is a bit difficult. It's not it's not easy to just get up, take up your dumbbells, go on your veranda and just motivate yourself to do it. When you go to the gym, you have all those persons working out. It's way easier. Plus, you have people that you hang out with that actually pushes you. Because when I used to go to the gym, I had friends that used to tell me what to do and tell me, you're not coming gym today or stuff like that. So it's a bit difficult doing it at, at home. However, we have no choice but to do it at home because this virus is getting out of hand. It's also a bit scary. So I message to persons out there who actually are going through a lot right now. Just pick yourself up, pray about it. Don't harm yourself. I've been seeing a lot of stuff on the news, persons committing suicide, persons just not, they're not doing well. And I get that. I get that it's difficult because some days, some days it's difficult for me to get up and do stuff. Some days I just want to stay in bed. Some days I wish I could go on a date. I wish we could go to a party but it's just a sad reality make home fun try new stuff watch youtube videos watch a movie i found a site the other day um i just google search free movies and it came up and me and my friend end up having a movie night and me and my boyfriend but yeah end up having a movie night and it was pretty cool just relaxing we have a little speaker box and it was a great night we didn't spend any money we were safe at home so find some stuff to do while in quarantine and so my key takeaways from this video number one get yourself a gratitude journal this one is really nice you can look for this one because it gives you prompts start writing in this every day if you can it really helps you can also get yourself a notebook or a regular journal just to brain dump in the mornings just to write your feelings get it out this would make you feel a bit more relieved write about quarantine write about the virus you know maybe someday you could be telling stories to your children um pamper yourself get yourself some masks have a spa day at home treat yourself light a candle listen some music and just hold our vibes and lastly devotional get close with god and read your devotional write a little review read a scripture you don't have to do it every day, but try to do it every day if possible. And lastly, find a book to read. Do something educational. Start a course. I know it's difficult, but one page at a time. And that's basically it for this video, guys. Keep safe and ensure to like, share, and subscribe. You can check out my other videos. I have a lot of videos up now. And let me know. Leave a comment down below and let me know what you'd like me to do for my next video. Bye. Okay, so loves, thanks for watching and ensure to like, share, and subscribe.